What are you gonna do? I have a plan, and it's really good. I'm gonna postpone telling him until you figure out what I'm supposed to do. So get cracking. How is this on me? Oh, I'm fine, I'll do it. God, who keeps emailing me? A penis. What? Oh my God. Oh. It's emailing me too. Whoever this is, send it to every woman in the entire government. Oh my God. He's gotta be so embarrassed. I mean, that's a crazy accident. No, Andy, he did it on purpose. You know what? Respect. That's a baller move. Pun intended. Excuse me. Chris, Jerry's making us look at dirty pictures on his computer. It is exactly because of that lewd photo that I am here. Ben and I are launching a full investigation. I want to apologize to all the women and Jerry. If I could go back in time and cut your eyeballs out, I would. Wow, that is so sweet. Thank you. We are getting a lot of media requests about this. So, Leslie, can you do Pert Hapley? Oh, she could do Pert Hapley. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, can you do his TV show? Oh, yeah. Mr. Mayor, I promise you that we will find the owner of that wiener and we will punish him. Goodbye. And Perkins. Hey, I didn't know who to come to with this, but that picture, uh, there's something very disturbing about the testicles. I've always felt the same way myself. The testicles are like the ears of the genital system. They serve a very important function, but they're not that great to look at. Okay, wow. No, I, I was speaking medically. They're enlarged. I think that maybe that guy is sick with something, perhaps a hernia or mumps. Aunt Perkins, you really know your testes. Thank you. Ann Perkins. Hey, did you maybe tell people that I diagnosed that guy with mumps based on his porn photo? I did. I'm so proud of you. OK, because now I have everyone in City Hall sending me pictures of their junk asking me if they have mumps. Oh, my god. Your inbox is literally filled with penises. Mm -hmm. I am so sorry. Oh, look. Ed Miller from Payroll. <laughs>